All right, so this is kind of the trick to pressurizing your system. And it's kind of a hard trick, and it takes some getting used to. First thing, slowly shut down the fluid that's coming into the system. Drop her down to it's almost stopped flowing. Then what we want to do is then increase the pressure back up by starting to restrict the outgoing flow of the system. So fluid flow is coming in. I would have looked on my flow meter and I would have seen it drop a little bit. Now I'm going to start to shut the return line going to my fill pump. And I'm going to just slowly do this because the fill pump station that we have is producing some serious flow. So I don't want to shock the system by ex exceeding it, but I do want to just gently start going until I can start to see the pressure rise. So I'm not seeing anything yet, but we're getting closer because I can feel that valve body starting to really start to compress inside of there. So I'm going to keep going here until that pressure starts to see that pressure's coming up now. Pressure's coming up. Pressure's coming up. And as that pressure comes up, the flow should not change. The flow will still remain the same, and it is. Notice the flow has not gone down. Now what I'm going to do so I'm going to gently start to decrease the inlet. Again, it's down. Notice the flow is way down, so the flow is getting restricted. I'm building pressure on here. You can hear the pump winding down. And now I'm going to start to increase the pressure again. And I, it's a balancing act between these two valves until I'm fully shut. I've got no fluid flow. So right now there's no flow, and I've shut the inlet down, and the exhaust side has been shut down. I am now at eight PSI. I am just gonna gently crack the pressure side, the flow side, until this comes up to the 15 that I wanna get to. And then once I hit that 15, then I'm done. So I, you can hear the strain on my fluid pump, and right there it is 10, and that looks good enough for, for what I want. And now you can hear the whine of that pump because there's no more flow, and we're done.